What do you say we try to find some good S13s? We try that every time. All right, you want to see something you do like? <laughs> yeah, let's give it a shot. <laughs> How about one where it's two pictures of the engine bay with cut out uh, wheel wells, and then the third picture is a list, and then the fourth picture is drifting. Three wheel motion in this picture. More drifting, smashed up at the track. You get the idea. This car is f***ed. <laughs> Look at this it, from car. God, it looks sad as f*** there. Yeah. It hates life right now. It reminds me of the cars in the junkyard in, in Brave Little Toaster right there. I took a Texan to a wedding. That's like one of the lines in the song. I'm not that once familiar with Brave Little Toaster, took a Texan unfortunately. took to a wedding. <laughs> what happens? He, I don't know, he, that's it. He like dies. He's like, now I'm golden and I suck. Oh, and then I there's see. like a C2 Corvette and talks about he took a trip on Route 66 and now he's just old and it's a sad song. They say anything about taking New Mexicans to weddings? No. New Mexicans don't get wed and don't get married. They have kids out of wedlock. Oh yeah. Pull it up. It's called Worthless. Saddest movie when I was a kid. Yeah, dude. It's like a scary movie legitimately to watch as a child. And that lamb is a d sucker. Damn, she could get it, huh? Oh yeah. She's exotic, you know? Oh yeah. Her dad was a GI. The TV's <laughs> trying to be a boy and like get the dude to go to the junkyard to get the old appliances. That get lamp like sent her to the junkyard, I think. I don't remember, but he was an asshole. Oh, I was f***ed up, dude. <laughs> Take care of your cars. This one's sad. Ah, oh, Jesus. There it is. <laughs> Once took a Texan to a wedding. Once took a Texan to a wedding. This is f***ed up, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Wrath of Mars says it's too bad they don't scream when they get crushed. <laughs> so Sebastian says, LMAO get clip stupid ass car. <laughs> <laughs> Dumb bitch. Yeah, but that's where this belongs for sure. But take care of your cars, kids. And like, they're going to turn out like this. Dude, the fucking race car saying like, I used to be top of the line and shit like that. And mm -hmm. dude, that's the fucking truth, man. Cars, every car that came out at one point was, was top of the line. When they get older, technology passes, things get better in quotes you know better and we have to take these cars for what they are you know these 240s sure you can make them fast but you you, you ruin them in the process a lot of people doing it are just too stupid to understand what they're doing or you just wreck them drifting and kill them you know and then the poor thing is just sent to the junkyard and, and that sadistic fucking magnet kills them thinking about how he once used to drive a guy to work yeah then some <laughs> modded me once yeah, yeah. We <laughs> i once helped a high schooler lose his virginity <laughs> he f***ed a girl in the back of the hatch And then he got stains on my seat Damn. Worthless <laughs> Trying to talk some shit. Discord.gg slash feed Let's talk some shit, bitch VVTi2J 400 horsepower at 10 PSI 500 at 20 PSI Capable of more on E85 $20,000 I'd rather have the convertible than this thing for 20 grand <laughs> What sucks about these drift cars is like, yeah, dude, you put a lot of money into it, but look at it. Look at it. It's a piece of shit, dude. Yeah, it's a mountain of crap. If I had the money to like really drift like that, I'm going to build my own car. Yeah. Sorry. Unless you're like really dumb. You, you got to have probably, the 240. You could probably buy it and you, like you could probably buy a, a pre-made drift car like this and save money, but who knows how much labor it's going to take you. You will almost have to un every single thing on the car. It's a mess. Like, you have to do it yourself to know what's right. What do you say we try to find some good S13s? We try that every time. I mean, more sincerely, though, like, instead of stopping to make fun of the drift cars. The bad ones, we just go, yeah. If, if it's a, if it's clearly a purpose-built drift car, we'll just skip it. Okay, so how about this, then? Yeah, yeah. Discord, find what you think is a good car. Yeah. And and put it in podcast while, while we're going, you know? Good cars only. We will, we'll just skip over any that look like yeah, that works. All right. Yeah, because these are all worthless so far. We need to find some that can be saved from the junkyard. Like this 84,000 mile rebuilt title uh, S14. 95, What's in the 9, driver's bucks. seat? Uh, piss bottle? It looks like the f***ing condom in Blues Brothers when he gets <laughs> out of jail. One prophylactic, unused. One soiled. soiled. Most of the front end's been replaced with uh, one off of a burgundy S14. Except for that fender. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's got one original and then the rest is... So it got hit on this side. Zero frame damage or rust. Let's take a look at the engine bay. It looks pretty straight. This does. This actually looks pretty fine. It's still got the original foam in there. Yeah. All the connectors are there. Still a salvage title. Still $9,000. The airbag did deploy, so that's why you got a salvage title. Yeah. 
that thing is blown out. The S14 airbag looks like it tried to deploy just from age. And it couldn't. Yeah, like it couldn't it's like, get out. It was like, <laughs> <laughs> that's all it got. That, 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 looks passenger, that passenger airbag, though, it's like throwing a hot dog down the hallway now. You want to just look at what they're sending us? They, they think these are good ones. Yeah, let's look at what they're sending us, yeah. We got a 92 240SX SE convertible for 7800 bucks. Livermore, California, 196,000 miles. Special edition, clean title in hand, smog check in hand, runs and drives good. Automatic, convertible works but it's ripped from the back glass. Interior has wear ends, has some rips. Exterior in great shape, AC and heater, power windows and locks, all original car. Tires are new, clean overall, hard to come across, original and clean, and Hablo Espanol. $7,800, not $20,000, completely stock, 200,000 miles admittedly, but it is a 240SX, what do you want? It's, it's, it's oh, an, wow. <laughs> Exterior-wise, it's a good condition. The seats are wild. wild. They're, they're wild, yeah. Oh, look at that. And the dude's been f it down there dog got in here and ate the top of the yeah. seats wonder how he made them red he definitely didn't sell them like that no that is bad it doesn't look good it's next level bad but it's gotten down to 7800 bucks it's dude it's really nice though for 200,000 miles like wow I'm shocked at how nice it is from the outside yeah it's beautiful 196,000 miles I wouldn't buy it though no. And from out here, the red seats work with the white car. The inside does not work. But from it's a distance. It's too much. When you, when, yeah, when you really look at it, it's too much. Getting in and out would be rough on your eyes. Here's an 89 Fastback, one, two, three, four dollars 18 weeks ago in Barrington, New Jersey with 110,000 miles, and he's looking for trades, open to offers as well. 89 240SX with a 91 engine, runs and drives well, currently my daily driver. Idle's a little rough, but I drive it every day. New alternator, battery, intake, and mass airflow sensor. He's taken the wing off. It has the original paint. It's in Jersey. The lip is all f up and like the lips like coming off yeah he hit something and it pulled it under but that's okay that's not that bad i don't know what those seats are short ram They're hot like air intake eBay, you know ebay and yeah uh, if he, if he but, didn't mention e other ebay seats yeah ebay gaming chairs yeah look at these look at these things yeah yeah it's got the sleepy eyes that are way yeah. off. You got to do it manually if you want sleepy eyes or else you wind what's up like with this. What's that guy's name again that we've... Forrest Whitaker? For, yeah, it looks like Forrest Whitaker eyes. Yeah, right. it, it doesn't have sleepy eyes. It's for, Forrest Whitaker eyes. Yep. Classic Atlas pull. Um, one, two, three, four dollars. He's looking for trades. And he's daily driving this car. Who knows how much he wants, though? Yeah. I wonder what he wants in trade. He should have mentioned what kind of cars he'd be interested in. Especially since he lives on that disgusting East Coast where they can just swap cars like... Yeah, uh, like girlfriends. Yeah. Like, yes. It's weird up there in the Northeast. Yeah, dude. Like, everyone dates the same girl. They just take turns. Like, what the f***? They all f*** the same cars. What's wrong with you guys? Yeah. Hit up my OnlyFans, guys. Uh, <laughs> at Collector Car Feet. Might as well start it, dude. You remember when, um was doing OnlyFans? Yes. <laughs> you remember when was doing Patreon and selling And he would say more tokens, more That's yes, right. <laughs> but he was, he was like in jars and that was a membership level on his Patreon. <laughs> Unironically. <laughs> that guy is so cool. We should have him back on, honestly. <laughs> uh, the world isn't ready, man. They're, f*** the world, dude. They need to know about <laughs> Here is a 96 240SX Coupe, 8500 bucks eight weeks ago, Los Angeles, California, 56,000 miles. 56,000 original miles for 8500 bucks. I thought it was a G35 at first. <laughs> <laughs> what is wrong with this car? Well, it's two months ago, so it's definitely gone if any of this is legit. Clean title in hand with Copart paperwork. Those are clean title and Copart don't normally go hand in hand. No trades. It has a new paint job, which, you know, okay, it is an old car. Maybe the paint was shot. Let's take a look at some more pictures of this thing. They're all phone pictures. That's a red flag. Okay. The, Nis the back of a Nissan badge in the yeah. cage cluster. Yeah, that's an odd one. Engine bay looks fine. I, I wonder if it was like a Cars for Kids donation. The first yeah, picture is like in a salvage yard. Like, look at this. Yeah. Or maybe it's a body shop. Maybe this is when it got painted. It has um like anniversary Z33 wheels. Yeah. In prior accident, dash wrapped with leather, but clean title in hand. Okay, so it, it was yeah. an accident that wasn't on insurance, is what happened yeah. here. Okay. Yeah. Okay. For a car that's probably been wrecked, it looks pretty good from yeah, these phone, it, you know, screenshots. It look terrible. For yeah. 8,500 bucks. I'm if you're in the area, go sold, look. honestly, in California. It's in Los Angeles, so something's definitely up beyond. I mean, it's, it's probably already gone. Let's be real. Yeah. 
Well, hit him up. See if he still has it. Go get it if he does. I mean, honestly, it doesn't it doesn't look bad. Go go get it a shot. Not a 240, but pretty clean. Not going to lie. It's a d- GTI. Can't 20 see. grand? With a whale tail? And he's trying to front next to a fucking 911. Get the f- He's just showing here, off dude. that he's got, he's got the same whale tail on. That's all. I mean, I get it's a GTI, but damn. It's the world we live in, though. So, you know, I, whatever. It, it looks well put together. I don't know shit about Volkswagen stuff. Yeah, I don't know shit about it all i can say is that from this picture it looks kind of cool if i saw it though i'd be like oh f- is that a dodge omni <laughs> is that <a> glh <laughs> yeah 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 do get all pissed no dude this is it, this is actually a volkswagen it's a really it's nice a integra call the, it's called the gt guy hello kitty edition we'll get back to that in just a second here's a uh, 96 246 coupe i think i had this pulled up earlier we didn't look at it uh it's got a minion Minions. on the ass 96 246 5 speed K 24 DE runs and drives good but needs a throttle position sensor which I may end up replacing before I sell. You should absolutely do that. Comes with tons of extra parts like two turbos, five lug swap for the rear, two rear calipers for dual caliper setup, so it was a drift build, extra dash, drift spares, so it was a drift build, intercooler piping, extra set of headlights and taillights. There is more in I there's more I'm forgetting, I'm sure. Has a fuel comes cell with, and welded comes diff. With du- <laughs> comes with double headed dual. Oh, it was a drift build. <laughs> <laughs> this is a piece of shit, dude. How much was it? Comes with ball gag. Oh, oh, it was a drift build. <laughs> it's five thousand bucks. This is we're we're into shell territory. Okay, if five thousand bucks, if you're trying to drift, I mean, look, bad. he's keeping those he's keeping those calipers real nice for you, dude. Yeah. Jesus, this thing's beat up. What? 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 Why did he put the minion sticker on? I want to know who put that on there. I mean, it's it's giving the right reaction to the car for what it's worth. Yeah, it's true. I mean, he's got like a thousand dollars in fucking dumbass seats here, at least. Ugh, the blown. Uh, he's got the fuel cell. He's got the blown airbag. I mean, it's it's a drift car. Whatever. Who gives a shit? wink mirror? Screwdriver shifter. Yeah. All the usual. All the usual. Yeah. Tricks. This is. But this this is like complete soon car. It's a pile. It's a pile of shit that this dude bought a bunch of parts for, thinking he's gonna. He's going to become a drift king. Oh, yeah, it's a nine. It's a K24 DE that needs a TPS. And then he has all these f***ing parts. This is a total soon build. Like, he's got the intercooler on the floor. He has two different turbos that aren't on the engine. Yeah, yeah that's that's it's tight, just like Because he thinks, he thinks, oh, when I get to it, I'll have everything. Yeah. And that's right. like the soon mentality. It's like... I'll buy it's it like, bit by bit for the cheapest yeah. amount humanly possible on the Zilvia classifieds or more than likely the Facebook local listings and shit. Yeah, no, this is, he just wasted a bunch of money and now he needs to sell it. It sucks. Yeah, I'll buy the easy sh- and then I'll be like really good at cars by the time it comes to the hard sh- Like that's their mentality. <laughs> yeah, 100%. And I understand that mentality, but you know, you don't, don't get into that. You this gotta be you realistic. Yeah. You ha- yeah, you have to, you know, know yourself. Yeah. I understand how you could, you know, trick yourself into thinking that that's going to work out, but it won't. So don't do that. You wind won't. up like this guy. Selling, selling this thing for 5,000 bucks. Yeah, what is because all this? legitimately, I'm telling you, somebody, somebody that does know about building 240s and just wants a drift car. Yeah, this is a great deal for them. Yeah, absolutely. So, did he move the fuse box to the back? Is that what this is? I, 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 yeah, yeah. Gotta make room for that turbo swap, dude. No, dude, it's like it's it's for it's for a uh, tucked bay, bro. It's a tucked. The bay has been tucked, bro. Like I needed, I needed mm-hmm. the bay tucked off top. That was the most important thing. And the wink mirror. I needed the wink mirror, and I needed this H in uh, air freshener. That was so it was important to the build. It was all key to the build. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. No, imperative. It was, oh, it was imperative that I had that I have these seats on my non-running car that I've never driven, but I know for heart for sure, hundred percent, that I needed these buckets. Dude, it just needs a TPS sensor. It's okay. <laughs> now this sucks. The Hello Kitty. No, this is this based. Dude. Nah, this this guy thinks he's cute, dude. This sucks. Yeah. But oh, it's in pu- it's in Puyall up. It's in Puyall up, Washington. Two hundred thirty thousand miles automatic transmission. It's pink on the outside. It's black on the inside. Sale is postponed due to an issue popping up. I refuse to sell the car with any major known issues. I do not want anyone to purchase and be stranded on my account. Thank you for understanding. The car is wrapped, not painted. Interior and exterior in good condition. Automatic transmission is slipping in first gear a bit, but is still drivable. Lots of new parts and maintenance done to the car recently. But it's not for sale at the moment, so don't even ask, dude. For 3500 bucks. Come on, man. 
No, man. Take the f***ing dumbass wrap off and those stupid-ass eyelashes. You take the wrap off, you're going to pull the paint off with it. This car is okay, shot, It's 3500 bucks. This sucks, dude. You dude, like this? Have you seen it? Have you seen Impreza? Impreza? You have like you seen this, Integra dude? prices? Ugh. Have you seen Integra prices? I'd buy an RSX over this. I'd rather yeah, have, have you seen RSX prices? It's got a quarter million miles. You can get a quarter million mile RSX for a little more than 3500 bucks. Plus, this one has like a bad transmission too. Oh, oh, f that then. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There you go. If it doesn't, if it doesn't run, f that. There you go. There you go. He thinks he's cute, dude. I hate it. No, it's. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. 